Hello everybody, my name is, of course, Griffin, and welcome back to another video. Today's video is based off of a simple question, really. Can you run Adobe Premiere on a MacBook Air? Well, the short answer is yes, you can, uh, but you do have to make some sacrifices. Before I begin, I do want to mention that the computer that I currently have is the early 2015 MacBook Air. Uh, now, I have been editing and doing other intensive tasks on it, for about a year and a half now. Anyways, I recently got Adobe Premiere Pro, and I wanted to make this video to report how performance is on this kind of computer. In the first few minutes of editing, everything works fine. However, the first thing you will notice is that after some time, the computer will heat up a lot, and playback becomes an issue. Sometimes it is nearly impossible to play video, sometimes it is completely flawless, and most of the time it's just a bit laggy. It differs for seemingly no reason. When the computer is working hard, scrubbing through video clips is rarely achievable, and if it is, it's very slow and unreliable. So the process of editing itself, although slow, is workable. Exporting video is another major factor. To get concrete results, I completed a test. I filmed the same basic video of me just pacing around my room twice. Each video is exactly 60 seconds long. The first video I shot in 1080p at 24 frames per second, which is a popular film standard today. Then I shot another video in 4K at 30fps. I popped both videos into Premiere, exported them, and timed how long it took for each one. Note that these speeds are also heavily dependent on Wi-Fi strength, and I have a normal Wi-Fi situation, nothing special. The 1080p video exported in 3 minutes and 18 seconds, while the 4K video exported in 14 minutes and 2 seconds. So I would say that intensive video editing is definitely possible on a MacBook Air, although it may be slow and frustrating at times, and is definitely not good for the longevity of your computer. Thank you very much, and I'll see you next time.